God damn, look at me, man. I seen me last time without the beard, but I cut my beard off about a month ago. Not purposely, but you see it's growing back and shit. It don't look, you can see how like thin this shit is compared to like, boom. I don't even know when the last time I posted on this channel for y'all just to talk to y'all and catch up. It probably been, it ain't even been longer than a week, two weeks. Cause I, I think I uploaded on this channel more recently than my main channel. I ain't uploaded on my main channel in about a month. Really, y'all, bro, I really, it's, it's happening, man. It's happening, man, and I'm extremely blessed, bro. Like, I really just been getting close with God, bro. That's just, that's just the key, bro. That was my key to everything, man. Isolating, well, it's just really God because I wouldn't even have knew the, that I needed that isolation if it wasn't for God, bro. Because our real life got lost in a hill. Like, I healed, but I didn't heal how you needed to. You know when you, like, I wouldn't say I improperly healed, but I didn't heal how I needed to. I didn't fully heal, you know, in the areas that, you know what I'm saying, that's going to help me, you know, keep going and shit. But i just been figuring out about myself. I've been learning myself. I've been goddamn studying myself, studying the world. I study life every day. It's just, it's just... That's my purpose, bro. Like, just understand life, man. Just and just spread the understanding of it. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that's that's my purpose in life. You feel me? And I gotta, I gotta like a art, a craft behind it. So it just makes it like two, three, four times harder. You know what I'm saying? Harder as in like cool. You feel me? But my mission is a little harder. You know what I'm saying? You know, I do got to tell it on me somewhere. I think it's one of these. God give his toughest battles to his strongest soldiers. I think it's actually this one of y'all. Probably wondering, why the fuck is you sitting in the car? Goddamn, it's 7 in the morning, too. What's your shirt off? Uh, I got out of work, bro, and I was goddamn hot, bro. And I was like, my shirt was sweated out. Not like sweated out, like wet, sweated out. Like, you know, you sweat, armpit, just more uncomfortable. Didn't like it. You feel me? I had to take that shit off. But I got another shirt, but I had the heat blasting in this bitch. So it was hot as fuck in this bitch. But, y'all, the brand is here. Like, in about a month, y'all, y'all gonna, y'all gonna officially see the Levert brand like launch, man. And I'm extremely excited, bro. That's all I think about every day, bro. I can't believe that I'm actually finally starting my business, bro. Like, at the age of 20, man, it's just new 22. Like, I just turned 20. And it's crazy that the things I learned because, and I'm glad, you know, God, I'm starting to understand why God does certain things because sometimes you think you might be ready for something, but in reality, you're not, bro. Like, God is making me a, a man, bro, a beautiful man, bro, before anything. You feel me? God wants to build a beautiful man in me before anything, and I'm extremely grateful and here for it, you know? So, I'm just locked in with god on that right now i'm becoming a beautiful man like inside out man like more so inside outside like it's just coming naturally i ain't gonna it's not that sounded like a flex bro i don't be taking care of myself as you can see like i take care of my like self like physically you feel me but like up here everything below i mean everything above the neck don't really get the most attention like my beard I work on my beard a lot, bro, because I ain't gonna lie, this has to stay. You, if you don't stay up the, you know, with the uh, beard, that bitch will get cooked. We don't need none of that. It's already, you know what I'm saying, as it is, you feel me? But my head, I do not keep up with, bro, and you can see, like, this shit is bad, bro. Like, that shit is nasty. My line and push back, I just need to brush that. Let me, let me brush that right quick. Let me brush that right quick. I know my brush in here. I ain't even look for it, but feel me, don't even look at that. Yeah, though, man, I'm excited, bro. My brand's starting. I've been working out a lot. As y'all can see, bro, you feel me? I got a little weight on me. You see the stomach, though. You feel me? Your boy is putting the weight on, man. I low-key lost weight, but it's coming back. I was 152 uh, a week ago, but I was, before that, like, I rarely weigh myself, so probably in, like, May, five months ago, maybe, I was probably got down 160, bro, and I never knew. Like, I didn't get to weigh myself because I was 155. I consistently lifted for, like, two, three more months after that. I stopped one summer hit. Like, a lot of shit was just 
beating my head up in the summertime so i was just getting right but I, that's really i just really want to catch up with y'all that was a cool little five minute talk i'm gonna post this um i'm gonna i'm gonna get more into my brand and talk more about my brand like I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I've been talking to manufacturers and getting my products. Like, you feel me? And I know it's getting cold outside, so I got a a sweatsuit coming out, man. So, y'all gonna y'all gonna love it, man. I'm loving it. It's, you feel me? Like, I'm gonna put my art. I'm gonna engrave my art and like aesthetic into my brand once I get it started. You know what I'm saying? I wanna I wanna just get it rolling first. You feel me? Because I wanna understand and feel the business. You know see where everybody heads at because of course there's a meaning behind my brand so i have to kind of mix that with my aesthetic in a way you know in a creative way some some creative way but like i ain't a lot when it comes to shit like clothing i'm a i'm a i'm i'm a slim simple then how the fuck you simplistic yeah simplistic dude like i really wear a a plain color bro like i wear all black bro you feel me all the time i ain't gonna lie and if I ain't wearing all black, I'm still wearing black and probably just do a bright ass color in the mix or some shit. But like, I just like wearing dark shit, bro. Like, it just blend in with me too. Like, I ain't gonna lie, I be wearing, uh, I used to wear white tees and shit, but when I put a black tee on and that bitch just sat in with my skin and just like, I never went back since, but. So yeah, we gonna work on doing that. So I really just wanna, Make sure everything going first. Like once I get my mock-ups, I said my mock-up, I'm a dickhead. Once I get my samples, y'all gonna really see about the brand. Cause I really I don't know. It's something it's like I'm burying myself. Like I'm protecting my energy right now. Cause usually, you know, and I've been like thinking about it for a while. Like, why am I not just putting it out? Like just let's talk about it. I don't know. The way God uh like, you know, in great like pushed it in my head to understand that. I don't know my plan not for everybody, bro, because I don't know. It's just the energy around me just is not meant for that. It's not meant to put in the air. Like, you could put something in the air. Like, I could throw something in the air. Somebody could come snatch it. Somebody could knock it out the air. Somebody could, you feel me, throw something on it and it come back down fucked up. You feel me? If you get what I'm saying, you get what I'm saying. So, I just like to protect my energy, you feel me, and, and my ideas and creative plans what like i like to keep that shit to myself you know what i'm saying so when y'all think y'all hearing shit on here it's so much shit i be wanting to tell y'all and i eventually will break my barrier once i get in a more comfortable environment to let y'all just free for all with all my you feel me what i got going on but as of now if you're seeing this like you like this to me bro like if you really watch all of these videos like if you're seeing this part of this video because it's eight minutes in so if you're seeing this we locked in, bro. Like, send me one of these or text me one of these. Comment one of these. Because I don't know who be watching these, but I be getting views. So, really, y'all, uh, I just want to just spread positivity messages with y'all. Like, because I know I go through a lot of shit. And I really just want y'all to understand that y'all not alone. You feel me? And I'm going to relate. That y'all can relate to this shit. And y'all can relate to me. And... We just family, bro. This is how this shit go. I'm high hell. You feel me? Every morning that I talk on here, I ain't gonna say every morning. That's what I've been doing as well, too. I've been trying to, cause I, I always, I always told myself, cause for a year, y'all, I stopped smoking, cause I fucked my body up, and I started again, like on some coping shit, and then it just went on and on as I was healing. You feel me? And then. I, I, when I first started, I, I kind of like, I was like, all right, I'm only do it at night. That's how you usually is. Or I'm only hit it once type shit. You get into it, da, da, da. Long story short, I used to always have a, like, I didn't just smoke. Like, I had to eat something, drink something, be prepared to smoke. I had to prepare to smoke. And smoke certain times. Like, don't just be smoking randomly at a random time of the day. You know what I'm saying? So, I've been working on getting back to that because I've been splurging on that shit in the past couple months. I ain't going to cap. Not done crazy. No, nah, nothing crazy. But I've been smoking more than usual, and I've been smoking at weird times, and it's not right. So i also been working on just uh, getting my like life together before I even do that. Earn your smoke. You feel me? Earn your smoke. You dig? So smoke when, you know, 
everything's done. You ain't, you know, so shit like that. You know, just a little shit. Being disciplined. That's the biggest thing. That's a big, I ain't gonna say the biggest thing, but that's a big thing is being disciplined. And another thing, y'all, my posture is so terrible. So, like, the way I be sitting and y'all be seeing my body, bro, and my neck be looking fat and shit, and I be holding the phone like this, bro, my posture is terrible. I ain't even been to the chiropractor in, I don't, I don't know, probably a year, bro. And I need to go back terribly, like, tremendously, ASAP expeditiously. That didn't even make sense. I'm hotter than a motherfucker. I'm getting big, though, y'all. I'm kind of proud of it. I got to show this shit sometimes, y'all. Because I don't think y'all understand, y'all. Y'all nigga I used to be skinny as fuck. Like, I used to be like... I don't know. If you know, you know, bro. I used to be a twig, bro. But probably, like... I probably graduated. I was 130. Probably. I'm 150-something. Almost 160, bro. I gained about 30 pounds in two years, bro. So uh, that I'm I'm grateful for that too, shit. You feel me? I I don't know. I was probably 140 last year, or I mean, I was probably one. Yeah, I was probably 140 in high school. Either way, I'm damn near 160, so that's almost 20 pounds. But hey, you know, we still going, man. I really want to get to 160 soon. I but I want a stable 160, not a goddamn like, not a uh, shit that oh, uh, if I don't eat for a couple days, my shit might go down. No, I want to be like. 165 like solid i don't eat for a couple of days i'm going down to 163 to 161 type shit so i want to get to stable 160 um within the next couple months we're gonna have our clothing brand running we're gonna have our youtube going we're gonna have like main channel videos flowing like i'm gonna have a plan or something or i'm gonna be coming up with the idea the plan of how i'm gonna post on my youtube my main channel I'm going to have real vlogs on this channel. We still going to have these talks. I'm going to still fuck with you, my boy. You feel me? We still, I'm still going to talk to you and shit. The early morning talks. But I really, it's time to get everything. Like, I'm I'm working on my discipline a little bit. But i always been working on it. It's just, I'm, it's aspects to everything you do in life. It's like having archetypes. You feel me? But this shit is 12 minutes. I did not mean to talk this long. I literally told y'all when it was five minutes that we had a good talk. You know, your boy don't be, your boy be needing to talk to somebody, man. I ain't been talking to y'all, man. So, y'all like the, man, why am I telling y'all like this shit, man? Fuck all that. If you rocking, scrap my shit.